The views and opinions expressed in this podcast do not necessarily reflect those of any major corporation whatsoever. It's episode 124 of the big show, of the big shoe, and we'd like to start out this episode like we do, like we've been trying to do all of the episodes, by trying to catch you, the listener, up. Trying to catch you up on the things that we're doing, because this is the 100 and 24th episode, and as a result of that, there's a possibility, however unlikely, that you may not have heard all 120 episodes up until this point. And there's a lot that we do on the show. So, uh, a, as a public service, really, to you, the listener, we would like to uh, catch you up on what has happened up to this point, what has happened to get us to episode 124. Uh, so we would like to uh, start off the show we've been trying to do lately with Previously on the Pope on Film. Yes. Well, the day finally arrived last week. The day that everyone has been waiting for. The big day. Lord Chatterfield's son was finally born. The heir to the massive Chatterfield fortune. Yes. Oh, my God. And what, what a gala event that was it was a huge event that was a huge event so a lot of people are upset about this about the fact that the uh, the baron chatterfield has now been born yes because a lot of people were were vying for that chatterfield fortune and of course lady chatterfield oh my goodness oh, what a lady whore. chatterfield whore. whore yeah still hasn't told lord chatterfield that Lord Chatterfield's brother, Roger, is in fact a father. She's keeping that. Mm. It seemed as if while she was in pain and labor that she might spill the beans, but she did not. And yes. she went through. And now Lord Chatterfield has a son, but it's not really his son. And of course, Lady Chatterfield fell ill right before the child was born. And now she's in a coma. So huge drama there. Yes. Huge drama. Really, edge your seat drama. Meanwhile, uh, Duchess Waverly's secret has finally been exposed. That was another big deal there. Huge deal. Mm -hmm. And let's not forget the fact that the butler was, of course, drunk again. Yes. Got to mention that. That butler always drunk. God, he's, he's so, so He's so funny. You know? Yeah, so funny. He's like Otis from Andy Griffith. You know? Yeah. He's hilarious. He's hilarious. He's not so, like the one in, in The Shining. Oh, yeah, no, no, not at all. So the big question is, will Lady Chatterfield emerge from her coma? Will Lord Chatterfield learn the truth about his newborn son? And will the butler be drunk again? Of course he's going to be drunk again. Yes. That's the butler. Anyway, what will happen? He's, he's going to get his own spinoff show. I think so. I think yeah. so. I think so. It's going to be Chesterfield, because that's the butler's name. <laughs> Chesterfield. Field. And he's going to be all like, yeah. So, will Lady Chatterfield emerge from her coma? And will Lord Chatterfield learn the truth? Find out tonight on the Pope on Film.